the hate army troll. It's the hate army, bro. Hate army. Shout that out guy. to hate. hate. Army. Good vibes to the Shout hate out to army. Hate. Shout out to hate. Shout out Shout to out hate. hate. Shout out to hate. Shout out for Shout hate. Shout out for hate. <laughs> How you been, Archer? Hope while I saw Kino's video. Apparently, I'm a super fan and conflicted. Ah, uh, dude. I have receipts. Um, and I've offered invitations. That'll always be my boilerplate response. Yeah, you'll. I'll. I'll tell the story in a moment, and I'm sure more people will show up later, and I'll help to tell the story again. I did not pull a tipster. I had no choice but to take down my like handful of recent streams, and I'll explain why in a few moments. I was not happy about doing it, but I wasn't either paying someone money or getting a strike, and I don't trust YouTube's editor. It's fucking ridiculous, too. It, it's Thank God I checked that email. I don't check the email that correlates with my live streaming account that often. Thank God I did. Um, lubricate my cheeks, Ricardo, and get into it. I made a mistake. Review, yes, I'm a stoner. I need to ease up USA. So I had this little bar of chocolate. And the guy was like, look, I would put it in the freezer because it'll melt. Because it's THC chocolate, by the way. 75 grams per square and once you freeze it though there is no fucking way you are getting square by square so i went fuck it and took a bite of it like a snickers bar i'm now fucking really 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 regretting that des decision and it was disgusting the flavor of the chocolate or white chocolate or whatever it was you know, like when you blow up like a, a balloon, a rubber balloon, that smell, that's what that tasted like with some sugar. Oh, it was disgusting. Don't want to be this stoned right now. It sucks. And the chocolate was disgusting. There was nothing worth it about taking that bite. I should have been like, fuck that and just had a normal dosage of shit. Pee on my Nepal. <laughs> Oh, my God. If you're wondering where the last, like, few of my streams, which haven't been many, have been, I had to delete them because the bird footage I used, even though I made it transformative with Phil's animation of fapping and my own music, was over it. As my brother's moaning like an ape from the other room. Um... Yeah, they. I use. Dare I use their bird footage? To me, that's like the equivalent of the artist who put together this replica chicken, saying, "I didn't give you permission to have my art on your table." When I first had the OLED monitors back here, which were a mistake, and I was showing like HDR footage, I just had some video looping. It was someone's video. I had to pay the money. Copyright laws are dated and broken. They are broken. Just uh, so just tuning in now. Not sure it's been addressed, but where are your videos? Yeah, that's what the stream is about. Uh, you remember how I had the enjoy birds intro where Phil was fapping with my text in front with the Phil I'm an animation half transparent in front of the birds. The person who I got the, the, the piece of bird footage from didn't like that I used their bird footage and I had to remove the bird footage intro videos or risk getting a strike on my channel. Actually, no, that's a lie, not risk. If I didn't do it within three days, you have a seven day period, just saw the email, I would have definitely gotten a strike for birds. <laughs> yeah. So no, I didn't have a tipster moment again. I didn't spurg out. I'm not trying to hide anything. I had to do that. I don't trust YouTube's editor, okay? It, it's spazzy. It may not edit it out. It may not edit it in time, even though they say it's like, what, 24 hours or something like that? No, hard pass. Don't want to risk it. 
It's not like I've streamed that much. So there's the glass half full part of it. So it's not that terrible. It still sucks dick. Uh, over fucking birds. Not fucking birds, but you know what I mean. <sighs> fucking birds is not allowed. That's weird. And look, man. Obviously, I'm not going to give any w away any information, but I even looked up the email that I got the YouTube channel. I'm like, this guy, this guy's for real. This guy's serious about this. This is real bird business. This is real motherfucking bird business. Oh, God. It's so frustrating. Like, this guy is like, even though you transform this, even though you have your own text, even though you have the animation of Phil and your own music, I know I'm repeating myself. I'm not that out of my mind yet. Nope, not enough. Those are my birds that could be filmed at any park. That's... Like, you know many people, on top of this too, this is another point I didn't bring up. You know how many fucking people use my footage? Especially now, many people who are talking shit. You know how many people just mirror my fucking videos? Which, yeah, I will strike you down if I catch a straight up mirror. Usually, if I give a shit enough. You see me doing any of that? I could be copyright claiming to my heart's content. Get the sticks out of your fucking asses, man. You're welcome, by the way. I mean, come on. It's just birds circling in a sky. Now, if I just took his footage and maybe just did the text part, even with the music, if I didn't have Phil's face, okay, I'll give him even with the text and the music because it's just his vanilla bird footage. Fine. But when you add Phil Fappin, and combine everything together. Come on, dude. It's, uh, maybe I should be this way. Maybe I'm missing out on like $20,000 a year. Copyright claiming a bunch of people. I'm a fucking ri idiot. Let me watch what I say. I'm just going to start being a dick. Use my footage. That's fine. Cough it up. Everyone else is doing it. Why am I being nice? You know what I'm saying? Want to spend two hours a day? Call me a fat fuck. Pay the toll. Pay the RTU toll. It, it ties into explaining why I've had to take down my recent streams. I had the threat of a copyright strike for the B-roll I was using in my uh, starting up the stream animation, which had birds. The person who owned that footage, even though I did not use that footage by itself, was not happy and they said I had three more days to either take those videos down um, or they said take a video down, but I, I used it in other videos, so I assumed it was all of them. Or I was going to be issued a strike for birds. Good old birds circling around in the sky. I don't know what, what could be more. Imagine like someone was just like filming grass. And you use that footage and then you put Phil's face fapping and saying stream starting soon with your music. And they're like, that's my grass that I filmed. I'm going to strike you. I had to take down like my, I would say roundabout, maybe give, give or take, maybe more, maybe less. Half a dozen streams because of the generic bird footage that came from a YouTube channel that I mixed with Phil's face and text and my own audio. I did not use the video's audio because I took some of that bird footage. I either had to take it down or get a strike. What was I going to do? Pay the guy for fucking birds? That didn't sound, that sounded real fucking weird, but you get my point. I did not mean it like that. Oh, uh, so that's fun. No, real dude, real channel. Checked it out. It was not a troll. I had that happen before where I reacted to a video of a guy getting a Turkish bath. He struck down the video. He was cool, though. Real cool guy. Um, I contacted him 
and he just said like all right would you mind just putting like crediting me in your live stream sure no problem and i did and i pinned his email uh as the top comment and it was cool but what the fuck am i going to do for like multiple live streams give this guy money for birds no pun intended i'm not trying to be funny it's the equivalent of having to give this company money because I have their bird on my table. No, thank you. The bird will just be removed from the table. Typically, he'll see more than anything.